No question about it, small companies are big business. At trade shows such as CES, South by Southwest, and dozens of other events, startups share the spotlight with all the big names. And nowhere is that more evident than right here at Mobile World Congress in Los Angeles. Four years from now is a marketplace here at MWC that looks at companies on the rise, asking the inevitable question, where will you be four years from now? This pavilion has much to offer. There are panel discussions, presentations, seminars, and an unprecedented opportunity to network with both peers and suppliers, in addition to exhibit stations featuring more than 100 startup companies. One such entity is a Toronto-based company called EcoCarrier, and Corey Mann here is going to tell us what they do. Uh, we're EcoCarrier, we're a startup based out of Richmond, Ontario, Canada. Uh, we work in AR, VR space. Uh, we uh, make apps for uh, Android and iOS store. Right now we are working on a new app called Mresence. Uh, it's basically to offer technical assistance where technical assistance isn't necessarily available. And basically how it works is uh, someone who needs help will, uh, will call up an expert and they'll be able to remotely assist them uh, with their phone to help them solve the problem that they need solving. What's well, really fascinating to me is that there are no AI glasses involved at all. It's all done through your smartphone, correct? Yeah. We chose to use a smartphone because they're the most widely available and in countries where they don't necessarily have the experts to help you with what you need help with. Uh, here in the West, obviously, we do have a lot of experts that can offer the help. So we chose to use smartphones because it's the most widely available and the easiest to use and to implement our app. Julia Motrand, did I get that right? You got it. <laughs> Excellent. Is the global operations manager for four years from now. Julia, explain what four years from now is, please. So, four years from now is the uh, uh, startup platform of MWC. Uh, we help connect startups with investors, uh, corporations, uh, communities, uh, and the talent. And, of course, uh, founders uh, uh, among each other, right? How many startups do you have here right now? And then also, how many do you represent overall? So uh, here we have over 100 startups uh, from, uh, uh, I would say, uh, uh, seven, eight countries. So we have four dele international delegations as well, Spain, uh, uh, Greece, uh, Japan and Korea. And in total, uh, we engaged with more than 3,500 3, startups uh, since we started in Barcelona uh, seven years ago. And as I recall, you cover four or five different tracks? Uh, we do. So uh, here in uh, LA, we are focused on uh, media entertainment, uh, connectivity, IoT, and tech for good. Cool. Nick Krasny is COO of a company called Radiant, based in San Francisco. They've got another great product here. Tell us what you do. We make it possible for businesses as small as the corner coffee shop to large sprawling fast food restaurants or hospitals or universities to take their business content and put it on TVs. You could kind of think of it as like an Apple TV for business, but instead of using a remote control, you can manage your content with our easy cloud dashboard. Tell me a little bit about your company. Um, well, uh, the company was started in 2016 by Tuan Ho, um, and we are now sub-50 people. We're spread out. We're based in San Francisco, but we have offices in Boston and Vancouver and, and in other places around the country. Excellent. Is this product available in the market right now? It sure is. You can buy it today at Radiant.com, R-A-Y-D-I-A-N-T.com. And of course, it's a B2B application. That's exactly right. Um, you know, again, we, we have customers that love us ranging from the corner coffee shop again all the way to Wahlburgers or, uh, or Harvard or Princeton Universities or the Dallas Mavericks. We, we touch all kinds of customers. Cool. Well, you're here in the pavilion called Four Years From Now, which begs the question, where will you be four years from now? You know, it's a great thing. Um, we're seeing large companies spending billions of dollars offering products that we sell for $50. Um, and we're really excited that in, in a world of virtual assistance, in a world of interactivity, in a world of IoT, our goal is to become the cloud platform for business IoT in brick and mortar. So imagine that level of personalization and interactivity that you might find on a website, but actually now suddenly being able to empower the brick and mortar location that you wa might walk into. Um, we're building that set of technologies today. Excellent, well, it looks like a terrific product. Thank you so much, we really appreciate you stopping by. Our pleasure. Take care.
In addition, there are several affiliated companies here that help startups get off the ground up and running. You've got your benefits and payroll company, you've got a law firm, and of course, you've got your obligatory investors. Trisha Meyer is founder and managing attorney at Meyer Law, and they're here at four years from now to provide services to startups. How is this working out for you? It's great. It's great. It gives us exposure and, and we get to meet uh, you know, members of the community and other entrepreneurs. Um, we help companies, early stage companies, with uh, corporate contracts, employment, IP, fundraising and privacy. So all of the things that they need to start up and scale their business. How aggressive do you need to be out here, or do these folks come to you for advice? Well, many of these folks come to me, you know, for advice as they walk by. We have some swag here that catches their eye, and I was also on a panel, and so, um, you know, many people came up to me after the panel as well to just learn more about us and the services that we provide. Now, obviously, the needs of a startup, an emerging company, are different from an established company. Paint a little picture for me about of what's kind of different when you're working with young emerging companies. Yeah, so the way we work with early stage companies is we'll usually set up a consultation call for half an hour. We'll learn more about their business. We'll understand what they have in place and what they need, what gaps they need filled. And then we'll outline it in a roadmap and estimate, explaining exactly what they need, why they need it, and how much it costs. And we do so much for early stage companies on fixed fee. They love the transparency, and they love that they have a good understanding of the scope of work and the fees before we get into it. Wonderful. Well, thanks to companies like Meyer Law, there's certainly something here for everybody.